When Janice was three years old, she was diagnosed with neurofibromatosis. This is a genetic condition that causes tumors to grow on nerve pathways anywhere within the body. When Janice turned five, they decided that they needed to operate and do a small section of her spine, and they put rods in and some screws. And when Janice got up for the first time, two of the screws went right through her vertebrae ended up having to have a second surgery, and then she was flat on her back at the Queen Alexandra Foundation for four months. After that time period, the doctors didn't think she was going to walk. Um, she surprised everybody by running into his office and wrapping her small arms around his neck and saying, thank you for letting me walk again. When Janice had that first surgery and, and we first got our diagnosis, she was put into a body brace to help keep her spine in alignment and keep it strong. And that body brace was paid for by a local charity. And Janice had decided that because they helped us out with this great cost of the body brace, she wanted to give back to the community. So Janice decided to start a penny drive And the pennies came in. They were coming in in buckets, they were coming in in barrels. Well that was the beginning of Janice's fundraising efforts. Over the years that one specific charity, Janice managed in seven years to raise 1.5 million dollars and 85 percent of that was in pennies. When she raised that 1.5 million she decided that she wanted to set herself a new goal. Hi everyone, I'm Janice. My dream is to build Janice Place. Came out of the experience of my family trying to find a place to stay. When we were in Vancouver for my medical issues, there were times when my mom and dad slept in a playroom in the hospital all night. That wasn't much fun. I want us to build a safe, warm, inviting home for families. My dream is that they will not be burdened with having to pay lots of money for a place to stay while their child is in the hospital. I want the community groups to come out in, and cook for the families and make their lives easier. I want an awesome games for the kids, but I also want a place for the parents to relax. My dream is to make sure no one has to sleep in a strange place when they come to Victoria for treatment. I want my place, Janice's place, to be their second home. So, so please, please help, help support, support Janice's place. place.